Have you ever wanted to be Shin Tails from the Sonic Tapes? Well, today I'm gonna be teaching you how to make Shin Tails from the Sonic Tapes in Brookhaven. Okay, so I'm my Roblox avatar. You know the drill. I have to get rid of everything. I have to say goodbye to the very expensive, super, super happy face. All right, so to do that, we're gonna go to the editor and just get rid of all the accessories you currently have on your character. Oh, but look at that beautiful Star Code Zeph Plays merch shirt. That's just so beautiful. Anyways, next up on our list, we are gonna need a body type. All right, so for a body type for a lot of Shin Sonic characters, I like to use the Robloxian 2.0. Now, you could use different ones as well. Like, I actually like this one kind of a lot, but uh, that little hood thing on the back, it's not very good. This is actually the Cool Kid McAwesome package, but we're gonna go with the Roblox at 2.0 for now. This should work out great. Now, a little tip to you guys, if you wanna spend Robux on the outside, you know, not on Brookhaven, you can use the Stick Bug package and combine that, and it makes a perfect Shin Sonic character. But for the sake of the video, since we're only using Brookhaven, we are gonna be using zero Robux. So, Robloxian 2.0 it is. Now, this is where things get really spicy. We're gonna start searching for some of the things that are gonna go on this character. Guys, can you help me out? Can we aim for one and a half like on this video? And if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe it down down below, can we aim for a half new subscriber today? So something interesting to note about Shin Tales from the Sonic tapes, it's a little different from Super Shin Sonic and Shin Sonic, and I'm gonna explain a little bit. So basically Shin Sonic is pure blue, Super Shin Sonic is pure yellow, but Shin Sonic Tales actually has some clothes on it. Well, what I mean is it kind of has the same like resemblance as Tails of like the shirt and pants that we would find in Roblox for a Tails Roblox account. So let's go ahead and actually just get a Tails shirt and pants. This is actually what we're gonna need. So this will work fine for the shirt and we're gonna have to find some matching pants to go with it. So let's I'll go over here and type in Tails right there and boom, this should match pretty good. Yeah, that's pretty much matching. Now we're a little limited in Brookhaven and for the sake of video, I'm not gonna do this, but we're gonna go straight to the skin tone and I'm gonna see what I mean. So if you wanna go a little bit of an extra mile, you could customize the skin tone in the avatar editor on Roblox and basically put just the arm arms as white. So basically that would show that Tails has gloves because Tails has white gloves, same as Sonic. And, uh, but for the sake of the video to save time, we are just going to go pure yellow or we're going to try to match the yellow as best as possible. It's kind of like an orangey yellow. So it's probably around here. That looks pretty good. I'm quite satisfied with that. But wait, I just realized something while I'm recording because we're going to be finding a head accessory later on. We can actually make the entire character white because we're going to have a head accessory. So it doesn't even matter what the head accessory actually is. Oh, but that might complicate some things with the head accessory we find later for Shin Tails. I'm, I'm gonna talk about it a little bit later, but what I'm gonna go ahead and do is go over here to faces and we gotta say goodbye to the super, super happy face. Unfortunately, we're basically just gonna take off a face. So now that we have a faceless head here in Brookhaven, this is gonna be very important because the head accessory we are gonna find later is going to determine how this character looks. We're gonna get into that very, very soon. But first guys, let's go ahead and customize the animation package. This is going to be a lot of fun. And what I like to use for the animation packages for the Shin characters is either the pirate animation or the elder animation. And does the elder animation exist? It does. So we get the old guy here and we're going to do every single animation as elder because that actually hunches the character over and makes it kind of look like a Shin tapes character. Oh my gosh. I kind of look creepy with a faceless tails, bro. Like, did you just see me look from left to right? You know, that little Roblox thing when I was doing that, it looked kind of creepy just with a faceless head. I'm looking like a weird Tails Slenderman hybrid or something. All right, getting into the spicy stuff here. We're going to go over here to accessories and I found the perfect Shin Tails accessory, which a lot of people don't know about. Normally, you would go ahead and type in like Shin Tails, but uh, that's not what we're looking for. There is actually one really bad kind of Shin Tails head that someone made in the Roblox catalog and I don't really like it. I found a better one that's not even named Shin Tails. So what you want to go ahead and search is Tails Proxy Head and what this will do, it'll find the perfect one. Look at this head right here. Oh my goodness. So guys, I'm about to finalize the character. Then we're going to run around and you guys are going to see the full advantage of the Shin Tails account here in Brookhaven. It looks absolutely awesome. Let's go ahead and do it. And boom. There we go. Look how crazy that looks like, bro. It looks pretty creepy with the head, the shirt, pants, and the elder animation. I think we absolutely popped off. So let me know how I did. Put your rating down in the comments out of 10 and let me know who else I should make in Brookhaven.